Let's just hang on. Testing, testing, testing. Welcome to the video. What's up everybody? My name is Just Mary and today I'm going to demonstrate on how you can play Ori in the Blind Forest on a 1920 by 1080 resolution rather than the 1536 by 864 resolution. So yeah, if you are like me and the resolution is locked into that 1536 whatever resolution and you want to change it to a better resolution, this is going to be how to do that. It's a pro tip from Mary. So um, yeah, if you liked the video, make sure to drop a like. Uh, on the video and without further ado, this is how we're gonna solve the problem So first thing you want to do is open up your steam client. Uh, this is a tutorial for a steam client Only I don't know how to fix anything else after you open up your steam client click your navigate to your library left click Okay, boom scroll down and then navigate your Ori in the blind forest boom Right click Ori in the Blind Forest and you should get a drop down menu like this. Uh, left click properties. Once you've left clicked properties, you should get a uh, prompt that says local files. Uh, if it doesn't, it should be on the side somewhere. Mine's right here in the middle. Uh, okay, so after you found your local files tab, what you want to do is you want to click browse local files. Left click browse local files should be up in the top right. Once you've clicked browse, the local files will pop up and you'll see a bunch of um, different applications here and a folder, a random folder. Uh, it might look a little different, but what you wanna do is you wanna go to the Ori, like the actual game, like you wanna actually go to the Ori game, the application, and you want to slowly right click, make sure it's highlighted, and then you want to right click the Ori application and then go to properties. Once you've gone into properties, you will navigate to this compatibility, which is the second tab over. Um, if, it, if you di don't see compatibility, you can't, you can't do this. If you don't see compatibility, try to highlight or the, try to highlight Ori first, the application, and then slowly right click. After you've navigated to this compatibility tab, you want to scroll down and you'll see this change high DPI settings. Uh, click that and then what you want to do is, uh, if this is, this is the issue right here, you want to have that turned off. I don't really know what it does, but you want to have it turned off. I don't really know. Uh, but you want to have the DPI scaling off, okay? Any of that off for the application. So click OK and then click Apply to apply those changes you've made. Okay, so after you have done those steps, you should be able to navigate to your resolution setting. Click that and you will be able to change it to whatever you'd like. It shouldn't be locked anymore. There we go. It is now changed to 1920 by 1080 resolution. And it looks beautiful. A lot more detail. A lot more wispiness. It is amazing. Okay. Now this is my first time ever playing this. And it, that was kind of frustrating. Changing the resolution. But yeah. Super excited to play Ori in the, the Blind Forest. Um, and I will be uploading the playthroughs to this YouTube channel. Um, so make sure to hit that subscribe button. Get notified when I do upload those if you are interested in watching them. And if this video has helped you out today to figure out how the heck to get out of that weird resolution lock, don't forget to leave a like. And hey, check out some of my other content, you know? I got some pretty good Sea of Thieves content, I think. I don't know. It, it's a work in progress. Maybe spare your eyes, actually. It's actually really embarrassing. It's a pro tip. I hope you enjoyed it.